I'd like to share with you a haircut from our new collection, Expressionism. This is the longest haircut within the collection and it's a continuation of uh, the Marianne haircut from last year's Identity collection. The main difference being this year is we have an asymmetric balance through the front area and we're going to work with a layering technique from the back area. Now I'm going to take my layering from the baseline working up to the crown area. So it'll simply be keeping maximum length, reducing weight all through this area using a point cutting technique and then working from the occipital through to the crown area, working to a shorter point. Once you've created that guideline, we'll then be over directing everything from behind the ear in towards the centre and again connecting in with point cutting. Through the front area, we'll then create a guideline from this side parting, which will give us our disconnected feeling around the front. So we'll create a guideline here and then basically work everything vertically down and elevating up into that shorter layer there. Moving through to the other side, this is where we want to create maximum length, keeping that asymmetric feel that we talked about. So what I'm going to do is work from the, uh, at the top of the ear, utilizing a diagonal forward section in pattern, and then creating an over direction from the front back to the ear. My product choice to help me establish the texture through the haircut will be two products from the Label M range. One is a curl cream, which we'll put in before the haircut, and then we've got a curl spray, which will define the, the texture as we come to finish the haircut off. The main inspiration behind this technique is um, something I saw on a catwalk show, which was Vivian Westwood, and the hair was actually put up, but collapsed in an asymmetric way, and worked with a very lived in texture. And what I want to do is just create that by utilizing this cutting technique. Hello, my name is Nana Gris, and I'm International Creative Technical Director for Tony and Guy. The ideas we want to share with you today is from our new collection, Expressionism. The technique we want to work with is blurred edges and one of our most used sectioning patterns, the teardrop. The inspiration behind it is the Marianne last year, where we worked with chalky pastels, working with crossover tones to work with the difference between in cool and warm tones. This year the colour choice will be similar, but where we really focus on is the contrast and texture, working with a shiny and matte finish. With the sectioning pattern itself, we're just going to be working with a teardrop section on top, slightly offset, working with the idea of Gary's haircut, and then accessorizing the hair at the side, working with a bit of a detail of a darker tone, working with mustard, gold, and a mauve. What we want to achieve with the teardrop on top is we want to work a slightly glowing feeling into the root area. The products we're going to be using is from the Weller Color Portfolio, working with blonde or lightning granules and the Colorstone Perfect range.
looking at the finished result now of blurred edges and I just want to recap the technique. The idea was really to work with a glowing surface so we worked with a teardrop section following the haircut working it into the point. The other section we wanted to emphasize was the shorter undercut at the side so just working with a soft curved shape. The colors we used all over was our soft gold, our mustard and then our mauve which we achieved by pre-light 